This is Binky Bowie on Fanfoot giving you the Binky Blast for the area. First boss, stay close because the room will be electrocuted when he casts Electric Cachexia. Electrocution is random and can't be avoided. Run back. Prey causes a purple tether to appear on a player. Stick the tether on a pillar so it gets the damage instead of you. This tether can be transferred if another player touches the purple line. Sometimes a squishy ad will appear. A dragon will attack once here and here. When broodlings die, there will be a purple explosion that doesn't damage you but will wake up a slumbering dragon if it's in range. The second boss spews poison gas clouds at players, and if you touch them, you'll get poison stacks that can't be removed. The mustard gas are your frenemies. DPS allow them to eat two or three balls of gas before killing them. Four will make them explode. The more gas balls on the ground, the more the boss is buffed. Don't worry about their aggro. They like gross balls more than you. No offense. Note to self. Don't buy property here. After a bunch of dragons, there will be a bunch more. And although it can appear overwhelming, they're pretty squishy. Healers, start the fight by focus targeting Justinian to keep an eye on his health and buffs. It's your job to keep him healed. Stone skin and regen make this pretty easy. You're going to have to stay between him and your tank. He'll target randos to spew fireballs at, so don't stand near Astinian. Spread out, and if he faces you, just move over to avoid it. Then they do this. The Sable Price will choose a known tank to scoop up. If you're marked, get closer so your team can break you out before you die. A bunch of whizzed off dragons will file in, each eager to get revenge on Astinian. There shouldn't be much team damage during this time so healers can focus on Astinian who ideally should have been at full health when this started. Again, stone skin and regen are very effective, with big heals peppered in. Only the big dragons can be tanked, and if you beat them in time, a shield will appear over Astinian that the team shelters inside for the hit that would have otherwise wiped you. And then just slap him with a wet noodle till he's dead. <laughs> <laughs>